we're at the uh, Georgetown Wet Weather Treatment Station. So flow comes into the station. It's a mixture of uh, stormwater and wastewater. It goes through some screens where it removes large debris. Uh, then it gets pumped up to the uh, process units that are behind me where sand is uh, removed. And then some uh, chemicals are mixed with it uh, to further uh, allow settling. Solids are removed uh, further. And then it goes on to disinfection with uh, ultraviolet light. Then it makes its way out to the uh, Duwamish River. So this station is only activated uh, during uh, high rains. And generally what happens, there's a pipeline that takes the flow from this area, uh, you know, from businesses and homes in this area, and sends it to West Point for treatment. Now, when it rains, that pipeline gets uh, overloaded. And to prevent it from backing up into people's homes and onto the streets, uh, we divert that extra flow to this plant uh, where it gets treated, uh, disinfected, and then uh, discharged to the Duwamish River. This facility is designed uh, with climate change in mind. So as uh, time goes on, we're going to see more intense storms. Uh, they're going to be of longer duration and more frequent. And uh, the capacity to manage that extra uh, stormwater has been built into this facility.